IBM Operational Decision Manager enables organizations to respond to real-time data with intelligent, automated decisions. Operational Decision Manager on Cloud provides decision service development and governance capabilities in the Cloud platform. This presentation introduces ODM on Cloud. You'll learn the differences between the Cloud offering and ODM on-premise. We'll also cover some security and licensing information. IBM ODM on Cloud provides a dedicated instance of Operational Decision Manager that is installed, configured, and provisioned for you. The Cloud environment is ready to use as soon as you log into your account. IBM maintains the instance to help ensure security and availability. Regular updates, including any fixes, enhancements, and new features, are applied to all customer instances at once. ODM on Cloud is packaged as a monthly subscription, charged over a specific subscription period. It enables you to quickly initiate business rules management projects at a lower cost by reducing the need for IT assistance or to acquire additional hardware and software. ODM on Cloud follows IBM's data security and privacy principles for cloud services. SSL is enabled across the ODM on Cloud offering. All endpoints require authentication, including the client applications that call decision services. Invocation of HTDS is authenticated by basic authentication. ODM on Cloud also provides a secure single sign-on using security assertion markup language. Authorization and user roles are managed by an ODM on Cloud directory, represented through the user portal administration page. There is no direct connection to a customer's LDAP system. The data in flight between the servers of the cloud is also encrypted and has high availability failover support. In short, ODM on Cloud securely connects people, applications, and devices in the cloud. IBM ODM on Cloud is hosted on IBM SoftLayer, which delivers an environment that is both highly scalable and protected by IBM Cloud security strategies. There are three ready-to-use environments that support a staged progression from development to test to production. Users access the applicable environments based on their assigned roles. The development environment is the main environment for collaborating on the development and life cycle of a decision service. It includes the decision center and decision server components. The Decision Center contains both the Business Console and the Enterprise Console for collaboration and project governance. The Decision Server Runtime Environment is used for running the decision services during the development activities. The Test Environment contains the Decision Server component only, and it's used for non-functional tests such as performance, system acceptance, and integration tests. In the production environment, the Rule Execution Server Runtime Environment runs the decision service in the context of the production application. ODM on Cloud provides similar collaborative role-based capabilities as those provided by the ODM standard on-premise version. The on-premise ODM components that are also supported in IBM ODM on Cloud are Rule Designer, Decision Center, and Decision Server. You access these components from the portal. Rule Designer is the Eclipse-based development environment where you can develop and integrate decision services. Decision Center provides two consoles. The Business Console is used to manage changes and govern the business rule lifecycle. You can use Enterprise Console for advanced rule management features. From the portal, you can also use the Rule Execution Server Console to manage and monitor the decision services that are deployed from Rule Designer and Decision Center. 
Note that the first version of ODM on Cloud does not include the Decision Server Insights component. You download Rule Designer from the Cloud Portal. If you have an existing Eclipse environment, you can install the Rule Designer plugins. Rule Designer for Cloud supports the pre-configuration of Rule Execution Server and Decision Center Cloud connections. The Rule developers use Rule Designer to build the Decision Service model and technical artifacts. Local run configuration and debugging is also supported. Once you complete the development of a Decision Service, you can publish the projects to the Decision Center development environment in the cloud. You can use the downloaded Rule Designer only within the context of an ODM on Cloud subscription. As well as providing Rule Designer itself, the download dialog also provides some supporting samples to help you get started. Decision Center is also part of the cloud development environment. It is a collaborative web tool and repository. Decision Center is used in the authoring and governance of decision services by a team that is led by a release manager. Decision Center includes the business console for all regular authoring, testing, governance, and deployment activities, and the enterprise console for occasional administrative and advanced activities. Rule Execution Server runs the decision services and makes them available as web services to external applications, processes, or services. It's available in the development, test, and production environments. Each environment has its own isolated instance. During the development phase, the rule developer can deploy to the res within the development environment. However, deployment cannot occur directly from rule designer to res in the test or production environments. Instead, Decision Center must be used, as it provides a governance framework and tracing capabilities to control the deployment of decision services in all of the different environments. In ODM on Cloud, users are assigned roles that determine their access to the development, test, and production environments. At the cloud level, there is one role for administering the environments. The administrator manages the users and controls the role assignments. Each cloud instance needs at least one administrator. ODM on Cloud provides a set of roles for users to collaborate as a team on modeling, authoring, governing, deploying, and integrating the decision services. The roles are Rule Developer, Release Manager, Business User, and Integrator. Rule developers use Rule Designer to create the model of a decision service and implement the initial version. On the local system, Rule developers can run and debug the decision service. After testing, they can publish the decision service from Rule Designer to Decision Center. They can also deploy it to Decision Server in the development environment. Business users work primarily in Decision Center Business Console. They implement and maintain business rule artifacts and run tests and simulations to validate any rule changes. The integrator builds the applications that call the decision service that is deployed in the cloud environments. The release manager orchestrates the lifecycle of a decision service and is ultimately responsible for deploying it into production. The release manager can take on all of the ODM roles. IBM ODM on Cloud supports integration with remote servers. It supports calls over HTTPS that use the SOAP and REST protocols with XML and JSON formats. Basic authentication over HTTPS is used to authenticate every API call. As for any SOAP web service, you invoke a SOAP-based decision service from a client application through proxy classes. The proxy classes can be generated from the web service's description language file provided for this service. The client application can also call the decision service through the REST API 
by using the standard HTTP GET and POST methods. To streamline the ODM on Cloud product, the latest and most up-to-date features have received priority. As a consequence, some legacy features from the ODM standard on-premise version have not been made available in ODM on Cloud. For example, the decision service is the only type of rural project for ODM on Cloud. If you have existing classic rural projects created in ODM standard on-premise, you can migrate them to decision service projects by using the migration tool in Rule Designer. Similarly, the decision engine is the only engine available in ODM on Cloud. Projects created with ODM standard on-premise can be migrated to use the decision engine in Rule Designer. For rule validation activities, you use the testing and simulation capabilities that are in Decision Center Business Console. The legacy DVS feature is not supported in ODM on Cloud. Some of the other features in ODM on-premise are not supported in ODM on Cloud. This slide lists them for your reference. Being on the cloud, the underlying infrastructure is not accessible. For example, you have no access to the cloud server operating system. You cannot access the application server console. You cannot repackage your files and redeploy the applications, and therefore there are no customizations of Decision Center and Decision Server. Furthermore, customizations of the value editor and data providers are not supported in ODM on Cloud. IBM Operational Decision Manager on Cloud is available from IBM Passport Advantage through a single monthly subscription that includes software, infrastructure, and management services, and delivers most of the capabilities of the ODM standard on-premise version. You can try ODM on Cloud for free. Use the URL on the slide to sign up and try it out. To learn more about ODM on Cloud, please visit the IBM Knowledge Center. Thanks for watching.